What is going on YouTube? It's Aaron with Lansing Lawn Service. I know it has been a long time since you guys have seen my face in a new video and I am going to explain why right now. Thank you for watching this video today. Please hit that subscribe button and join the lawn crew. Also, if you really enjoy this video, smash that like button and be sure to hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button just to stay notified when we put out a new video. Also, check out our Amazon affiliate links down in the description. Those links take you to different products that we are affiliated with and when you click on that affiliate link and purchase that item we get a small kickback from the purchase of that item and that just helps us to continue creating awesome content like this video. Now back to the video. guys so I'm all done cutting the grass now it's time to talk about where I have been for the last two months what have I been doing am I still in business all of the obvious questions that need to be asked and need to be answered so yes the first question am I still in business absolutely nothing has changed business wise I'm still in business still kicking grass in fact we are busier than ever and we're having our best year yet so that's awesome even though it has been super dry and I mean June and July were just massively dry months for us here in Michigan at least in my area um, and we have just been killing it still even with the loss of a lot of revenue because we you know we weren't cutting a whole lot in those two months we're still doing really well compared to last year so I'm excited about that now we are going to be making some changes coming up and that's gonna be in the spring of 2019 I plan to change some billing things I plan to bring on an employee I know I've said this before that I'm going to hire somebody or I plan to hire somebody and it just hasn't worked out this year to do that next next spring before the season starts I will have an employee and the reason that I will have an employee is because I can't take all this work by myself now if I bring on an employee I can bring on more lawns I can bring on more work and I am just at that point where I can't do it all myself anymore. I've had a lot of aches and pains this year. Uh, my shoulder has been bothering me quite a bit. And so it is time to bring on at least one employee, possibly two, because I am tired of getting call after call after call in the spring and saying, I'm sorry, our schedule is full. Like last year, I got to the middle of May and I was like I'm done I can't take any more customers then in June things slowed down a little bit I took on about five more customers and that I mean that is cramming it in so uh, yeah we I've got to bring on an employee the next thing I want to address 
is where I have been for the last two months. I think it's two months, maybe three months. Might, might almost be three. I have just taken a break from YouTube and basically social media. I've been very quiet on social media. The reason is I was busting the candle on both ends, okay? During the day, I was mowing lawns, cracking the whip. At night, I'd come home and I'd edit video. I was putting out, at the time, I was putting out two videos a week. And, I mean, I was loving it. I thought I was doing great. But my wife was not doing great. And we ran into some issues and some things like that. And I found out that I wasn't doing great either. Um, you know, last end of last year, I was battling depression, things like that. Or maybe it was this, I think it was this spring, actually. I was battling depression, and and that started to come back in uh, this, this spring. And so uh, I had to make changes. And those changes were tough, but it was really good for me. It was really good for my marriage. It was really good for my boys. Uh, YouTube is fun, and it's it it's a blast, and it does help the business. It draws people to the website. But you know what? It's it's a hobby. I don't make any money on YouTube. It is not worth losing my wife and my kids over. So that was you know that was the first thing out the window when my wife and I sat down and talked and it was like she just told me you know I, I don't like who you're becoming I don't like that you're on your computer 24 7 I don't like that you are checked out when you're at home and so I took that to heart because it was like things need to change or we're gonna change so you know out the window YouTube went and I'm hoping that if you guys are in the same situation you guys need to take the same sort of action okay YouTube is great and you might even make money on YouTube but if your family is suffering it is not worth it guys it is not worth losing your family over a couple of videos okay please Set yourself up, and I know most of you probably have. I didn't. I didn't set good boundaries. Set yourself up with really good boundaries with social media, with making your film, your, your videos, with your editing, your time when you're with your family. you got to prioritize, guys. You know, you guys know that I keep it pretty real and raw and... I am telling you, you have to prioritize your time. Please, please, please do not let YouTube, social media ruin your life, okay? Because it does, it can. Social media can totally ruin your life. I know people whose lives it has ruined. So please. Do yourself a favor, set up boundaries now. If you have to, take a month off and work on setting those boundaries because it is well worth it to hold on to your family and to push everything else aside. The value of your life is not in these videos. It's not in the content that you create. It is in the people that you love and love you. So please, listen to me when I say set boundaries for yourselves, especially you guys on YouTube, because I, I am here to testify that you can lose it all if you don't. All right, guys, let's bring this thing up a level. It's kind of down. Let's bring it up. So going forward, what are my plans? Well... As you can see, I am back on YouTube, but it is limited, okay? Videos, I have set up my business so on Fridays, I work about a half a day. 
and I also take my wife out for lunch on Fridays because it's a shorter day. So Fridays, new videos will be coming out on Fridays. I will also be filming and editing on Fridays. So content might change a little bit. Yes, I will film during the week. However, all videos will be done and out on Fridays and all the editing will be done on Fridays. So if there's a Friday and a video doesn't come out, well, you can bet your bottom dollar that something happened during that week where I needed to spend time with my family and not with my computer. And so that's, that's my priority. YouTube is not my priority. I love making videos. I love putting out content. I love the interaction I get with people. I love meeting people. But you know what? YouTube, it's not what it's all about. My wife and my kids, that is what it's all about. It's also not about the hokey pokey. But we are going to put out a video every Friday unless I need to take a break or spend time with the family or whatever. So be expecting the videos once a week. I'd love to do two a week. It's not possible. I'm not even going to attempt anymore. One a week. And it could be sporadic, but I'm just telling you I'm going to try. All right, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please take to heart what I said about setting boundaries for yourself. Please, I am just begging you to do it and do it right now. It could save you a world of heartache. All right, you guys are awesome. And as always, I will see you when I get out of the bathroom. <laughs>